called an audible on the route we were gonna take out. What's up, everybody? Warren and I, Evan the Mountain Machine. <laughs> These things have a bone in their pecker, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> I, just, I just hit record. That was perfect. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, it's, it's it's a funny bone. <laughs> right as you hit record. Uh, no, I'm not taking that out either. I'm uh, gonna you, leave it you in. You should leave that in. <laughs> Shit. That's funny. All right. Just like a deer, right? Is there Well, folks, anybody who's watching, it's the, uh, just, just turned into, uh, what is it, The Witcher? Yes. Uh, Blair Witch Project. Blair Witch Project. Yep. No. This is our final recording. We don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> Stay away. <laughs> well, uh, that, that hill was, it was intense. It was a testament. It really was. Yeah. That was, uh, really really uh showed us what we were made of especially me i i struggled up there evan just kept walking 20 feet in front of me and turning around and you okay man <laughs> but teamwork makes the dream work it right? does yeah he pushed me and we made it up and oh he was probably what 500 yards down 600 yards down i'd give hill. him about 400 okay yeah, yeah. It's, it was steep though it maybe it well yeah you could add a couple hundred yards in there just for effect i think, <laughs> yeah, okay. for, yeah. I, I think people would accept that okay <laughs> they, if they question you I'd tell them to go to the bottom and walk back up it so yeah yeah well somebody should do that because i uh realized about halfway up i forgot my sunglasses <laughs> down there so right on the gut pile right so, on the gut pile yeah the funny thing is that i think we realized that this wasn't the same bear that we had seen originally yeah that, uh, that other one had a really brown face to it yeah the first the first bear we saw it had a bright blonde muzzle and i, I knew it was a big bear and this bear is nowhere near the, the the size of that other one it's still a great bear um, yeah i'll take it first bear i'll take absolutely. it absolutely but there's definitely another bear in here and I, I think that it definitely winded us this bear was you know a little a little green so he didn't know what the hell was going on but mm -hmm. you know he gave us an opportunity and Telson put the hammer down, so here we are. Jacked. About 45 minutes from the truck, and it's literally all downhill it's from all here. All downhill from here, so yep. in the good, in the best way possible. Yes. Usually yeah. that's a negative uh, euphemism, but we're good to go. Yep. Yep. All right. Well, see you at the truck. All right. We made it back to the truck. You can hear it running. I couldn't be happier, man. My back is killing me, but it was worth every inch every mile we're feeling it though we're, we're gonna be feeling it for a couple days yeah there's nothing easy about bear hunting nope i don't care what they tell you as easy as we made it look tonight it's not easy no no yeah be uh be prepared prepare yourself i i did not come into this situation prepared um i have a limited draw tag this fall that i've been telling myself you need to get your ass in shape for and this was a huge wake-up call for me evan uh Evan stuck with me, and for that I'm grateful. He pushed me, for that I'm grateful, and uh, 
and we made it back to the truck and now it's time to boogie out of here and go get some food and some cold drinks. Yep. Yes, sir. All right, man. Let's do it. Thanks again. Yeah, no problem. All right. Glad to be part of it. Okay. Whenever you're ready, leg forward. Aim for that opposite so, side of the leg. Right in the middle. Your wife wants bear rug. Squeeze nice and easy. You go where the bears are. <laughs> and you get her a damn bear rug. Nice shot, buddy. We're watching some oh, yeah. born and raised boys right now. But, uh, yeah. Not sure exactly what I did to it. Uh, we did kind of some side hilling, pretty steep with a heavy pack. And did you get him? I didn't stretch before we got started, so I think uh, I think we might have pulled something. But uh, yeah, ankle swollen, killing me in an emergency run to the store to give me some ice and some bandage so we could uh, you know, do what the athletes do. Bucking is a sport. Does that make me an athlete? I think, I think it does. Look at this athlete, right? Slightly. So, so yeah. Now so I'm just trying to I think it's gonna numb it, dull it. Got a little uh, the wind little glass of scotch it. there and chocolate. <laughs> and chocolate. It so like it feels pretty pretty bad for me, but yeah, it was worth it. She'll be happy in a couple months when we get that bear out in the house. All right, so buddy Evan, who I was hunting with the other day, went back into the spot that I shot my bear and was going to get my sunglasses for me, and he got them. He got a little something else, too. Let's go see what it is. What is up? Hey, hey. Bear man Evan. Byron, how are you? Good, how are you? Oh, awesome. Thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> Funny, huh? Sitting right there on the gut pile, huh? Yeah. Yeah, not 20 feet from where that other bear was at. They're a little dirty, I think, but... Yeah. Not go. crooked. That's no. all that matters, right? No. I'm I'm a little uh, gimped up right now. I understand that. Yeah. I'm feeling it, too. Don't worry. Are you? Yeah. I think I grabbed the right pack, didn't I? Yep, you did. Oh, wow. Oh, there he goes. Oh, there he goes. Oh, dude. <laughs> yes. Hmm. Oh, that is a freaking awesome bear. A pretty bear. There it is. That's the one. That's the one, man. Wow. That thing is nice. Big old head on him. Big old head. That's him. For That's sure. him. I, I thought I was crazy when I... Because <laughs> I, I swore that the bear that I was looking at had a blonde muzzle and that's it. That is so cool. You know, he's... That is an awesome bear. Probably five, five, seven, ten, five, five eight. Ten. Yeah. I got a tape in the truck if you want to throw yeah, one Yeah, let's on. go and throw a tape on. His nose is really long though. Yeah, we got, yeah, five, seven. Five, seven? Five, seven. Yeah, he's a good bear. Oh, big old canines. Yeah. Big canines. Healthy. Very, he's a healthy very, dude. Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to mess with that. No, but I mean, he's like pitch black. There's hardly any red in there, and he's thick. Yeah. Short hair, that's the shortest hair of any bear that I've killed. God, that is just so cool, man. How it all it went just, down, it too. crazy. Yeah. You know, it was bizarre. That's how stuff like that happens, though, and for me to forget pretty much everything. The other thing that I meant to, there was the three things I told you, right? Yeah. That you need to take with you on your bear hunt. Yeah. Game bags. Uh-huh. Uh, rain jacket. Yep. And a flashlight, and I forgot the flashlight and the rain jacket. Had the game bags. I thought I was out. I had two more in the bottom of my pack. I shot him. It was, he was, it was downhill, it was right below, it was on the road bed where yours rolled to. Mm -hmm. um, and I was probably 75 yards below where you shot. And he gave me a quartering two shot, so I took him on the point of the shoulder and it came back at his last rib and I actually got the bullet back. Oh, you found it? Yeah, I was on the high. Air medicine right there, man. <laughs> That's a 6.5, right? Yep, 6.5 Creedmoor, 143 grain, Hornady ELDX. Super cool. 
125 yards. Oh. Man enough to say it, I'm pretty jealous. I figured you would be. <laughs> and like I said, I wish that we could have got you on this bear the other night. Oh. Dude, I was, and I'm just sitting here, I was like, there's no way that there could have been two bears that close to each other. My mind had to have been deceiving me, you know, maybe it was how the sun was hitting him, but I was like, no. I got a good look at him, I knew that he was bigger. Yeah. Here he is. Here he is, man. That is all, his, all his glory. Cooler yeah, than all day out. I'm hooked. It's addicting, isn't I'm it? I'm way hooked, man. I'm I'm with you now. I wish we could buy two tags here. I shot him. I think he's right here somewhere where the bullet would have gone in. Oh, so he's quartering to you? Quartering to yeah, dude. He went 10 feet. If Did he see you? No. Yeah, no, no, they got yeah. shitty eyesight. Yeah. I came down the hill a ways so I could get a better shot at him. But it was funny. It was It was like this. I was just barely leaned over and the weight of that barrel, it just, it doesn't move very fast. Mm -hmm. You know, it's its really steady and so I just was able to, I sat there and held onto the, I couldn't see him on a knee. Yeah. And so I just put my hand up against the, the magwell and leaned into it and waited a second, waited a second, let that crosshair float on him and just squeezed it. I, I saw the impact, that gun doesn't kick anything and I forgot my, I forgot everything. <laughs> forgot earplugs, <laughs> forgot my binos. It was funny when he called you. You were just going up there to get my sunglasses. That's all I was you? doing. <laughs> you no. just happened to bring your gun yeah, with you. Yeah, because I was like, eh, I'm not going to go for a walk in the woods with a bear tag and not take a gun with me. Yeah, yeah. So that's what, that's what ended up Most happening, people just so. don't pack 13 pound rifles. Yeah, right. 14. 14, 14 loaded. It's, it's, it's 14. <laughs> it's, it's probably like 13 pounds, 15 ounces now with one less bullet in the gun. But. But you can shoot it so bloody far. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's... it's. Yeah, it's, you only used about a quarter of your effective range. Dude, no kidding. <laughs> you spent all that, I really all that wanted, time I really practicing wanted, at 700. I really wanted to stretch it out there this year and yeah. see what it, what it could do. And I didn't get the opportunity to, but that's fine, you know. Anytime you can guarantee a good shot on a critter, it, it's almost better that way anyways. Yeah. But, so it's the first one that I spotted and I spotted him again on that ridge because I could. And I, then he disappeared and he kicked and his little brother off. Exactly, there. exactly. <laughs> so go take one for yeah, because I saw I saw his blonde snout when we were up on that that upper ridge too. Yeah. Has Chelsea seen it yet? No, no. We came straight from the mountain oh, here, so. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Yeah, no, I figured I'd get close, man. Yeah, yeah I, it was. Fun. I hit him, and I went down the mountain to to you know. I, I wasn't sure how well I'd hit him because he came he actually came up the hill and then he doubled back down to where he was at and disappeared and so I was kind of looking off to the other side expecting to see him come out of the bushes or whatever and I came down on that road cut and he was sitting right there yeah and I sat there like 20 yards above him and just watched him for a second he was done but I walked down to him yeah it's a big bear you don't want to just go running up to it, make sure it's dead. no of course I didn't have my pistol either so yeah. <laughs> whatever you know went down and turned him over and kind of looked at him for a second, set my gun and my back down. And then I walked 20 feet over and picked up your sunglasses. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is too convenient. I was headed down here anyways. Yeah, I feel like I earned a beer after that. Well, that is a wrap. I hope you guys enjoyed. Really appreciate everyone's support and I appreciate you guys checking out the videos. I hope to keep this going. And uh, thanks again for watching.